Welcome to the Beer Wiesen during Oktoberfest season, and I get asked this question all the time. What's the difference between a Fest beer and an Oktoberfest beer? Well, I have the answer to that question in this brew review. And welcome once again to the Beer Garden, or the Beer Wiesen, uh, as it is Oktoberfest season. And up this round, another fan request, got so many requests to uh, review, Weihenstefana Fest Beer. Now, tap that subscribe button if you're here because you love beer, and let's be honest, why else would you be here? Trying to get to a thousand subscribers as fast as possible. Hey, the more people in the pool, the bigger the party, right? And coming up in just a couple of minutes, I'm gonna rate Weihenstefana Fest Beer out of five stars, how good a Fest Beer or Oktoberfest Beer uh, this beer is, so stick around for that. From the world's oldest brew 5.8% alcohol Weihenstefana Fest beer. What's the difference between a Fest beer and an Oktoberfest beer, you ask? Well, I have that answer in just a couple of minutes, but it is another really hot day here in the beer season. It's in the 80s, very uncharacteristically hot. So before it gets any hotter, let's pop the top and see what we got. A very crisp effervescent opening, as one would expect from German engineering. And the difference between a Fest beer and an Oktoberfest beer is a Fest beer is a lager and a Oktoberfest beer is a Mertzen. Uh, so of course the Mertzen is uh, very typical with that reddish coppery color, uh, relatively high in alcohol, so to speak, uh, in the upper fives. And uh, a Fest beer is a straight up lager brewed sort of in the Oktoberfest style. Again, this one in the upper fives, 5.8%, uh, but it's actually the Fest beer that is served at the Munich Oktoberfest. And they've been doing that since uh, the 80s, I guess, maybe even the 70s. Uh, it's just sort of a lighter uh, beer if you're going to be pounding liters of this for days on end. Uh, even though the alcohol content is still there, it's not quite as sweet. It's a little more palate tolerant, I guess. I don't know. I love the Mertzen style. And uh, have sort of stayed away from the Fest beer just because I say hey, it's Oktoberfest. I want to drink an Oktoberfest beer. But all right, uh, it's time for the liquid to hit the lips because it's hot out here. I don't want to drink alone. Grab yourself a beer. Prost. Yeah, now I can see why they serve Fest beer as opposed to uh, Oktoberfest beer. Uh, it is a little more palate neutral. Uh, it is a lager. You do get uh, that sort of uh, Oktoberfest yeastiness in there, which I like. Not quite, not nearly as much maltiness, as you can tell just by the color of it. And it seems to be, at least the Weihenstefaner, is uh, a little more hoppy. I believe it was at 16 IBUs, somewhere around in that, which is a little hoppier than an Oktoberfest beer. So if you're into IPAs, and also you're looking for a beer to drink at uh, during Oktoberfest or during the October season, um, uh, I think you would definitely like this Weihenstefaner uh, Fest beer. Yeah, you do get that little bit of a <coughs> hop bite on the back end, uh, just a, uh, a, a little bit of that yeasty underbelly that I like, <coughs> but not nearly as sweet as the malty Oktoberfest beers. So I would kind of say it is a an Oktoberfest inspired lager, if that makes any sense. What could I compare this to? Actually, I would say uh, it's similar to an American West Coast IPA, um, maybe a Sierra Nevada, um, somewhere along the lines of that, because it does go down very, very smooth. And thank you all for your support of this channel. If you hadn't tapped that subscribe button, please do. And uh, thanks for all your kind comments. We've had uh, this one guy who used to subscribe who didn't like how I burped and slammed the beer. He thought that was just uh, unprofessional. He didn't like that. But hey, we're here to have fun. I don't take beer drinking too serious. Uh, and so yeah, hey, I burp, but I uh, like to chug the beer every once in a while. So thank you uh, if you're enjoying that. And uh, uh, I have one, le one less subscriber because of that. But hey, that's my style. All right.
Hey, let me know what you think about Fest beers, whether uh, it's Weihenstefana you've had or maybe another Fest beer. Uh, what do you think about it? How do you compare it to Oktoberfest? I, 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 in my opinion, a Fest beer is fine. It's all right, but I still prefer the Oktoberfest. I like that maltiness and I like that sort of, uh, it just tastes like fall to me and it looks like fall. So out of five stars, five being a very good Fest beer slash Oktoberfest slash beer you drink in October. It comes from the world's oldest brewery for a reason uh, because it is crisp. It is a typical German beer that you could just taste the quality. It's crisp, it's refreshing, it's 5.8% alcohol, it sneaks up on you. So out of five stars, I would give Weihenstefana Festbier a 4.82 out of fünf stars. Hey, let me know what you think in the comments, because I know you do. And also suggestions of other beers you would like to see me review. Love to hear them. And hey, it's a beautiful day here in the beer season. Grab yourself a beer, and you drink that beer. Prost.